Now tonight we're going to hear from a single mom of three running into a new problem that might be affecting more people soon. On your side, Jocelyn Howard brings us her story tonight. This single mother of three is crying out for help. Her family is hungry. They're having trouble keeping a roof over their heads and she's demanding answers. Is it just time for me to give up and roll my back and say this is it? I'm done. Just before the pandemic, Anne Marie Woods lost her job and exhausted her unemployment benefits. As she was looking for a job, COVID-19 hit and she was helpless. I went through my 401k already. I, I mean, I pretty much am wiped out. After exhausting benefits, Woods should be eligible for Pandemic Emergency Unemployment Compensation, or PEUC. The federal program provides up to 13 weeks of reemployment assistance benefits to individuals who have exhausted regular unemployment benefits. But when you visit DEO's website, it reads, more information on how to apply is coming soon. Every other state is pretty much there already. Pennsylvania, Massachusetts, Idaho, all with applications up and processing. Florida, nothing. I've been calling since literally the end of March. On the line for hours and hung up on. Oh, it's extremely frustrating. As Woods fights the unemployment battle, she is continuing to search for a job that won't put her child's life in jeopardy. Her son has severe asthma and COPD. She's worried if she works out in a public setting, she could catch the virus and put his life in danger. It's really hard for me to jump into a grocery store to know that I might bring it back to him and it would potentially kill him. I reached out to DEO for answers on the development of Florida's PEUC application process with no response. I don't know if we're going to end up having to be in a shelter. I just wish that they can get their act together. Jocelyn Howard, First Coast News, on your side.